Hey guys, what's up? I'm back with another video and I first want to apologize for my appearance right now. It's very late and I have been like so busy today. I literally, this is the only time I've had today to sit down and film a video. Like I said, it's really late so I didn't want to like put on a lot of makeup. I just kind of put on eye makeup and that's pretty much it. So today I'm going to be doing my March favorites and I know it's kind of late in April to be doing a March favorites but... Oops. Um, I don't have a lot of favorites, but I do have a little collection, I guess, to show you guys. My Urban Decay Naked 2 palette. This is like my child. I love it so much. If you haven't seen it, this is what it looks like. It is amazing. You can do so much with this palette. I literally use it every single day. Um, it's, it's great. It's one of my faves. Next is just like a pencil eyeliner. This is probably one of the best pencil eyeliners I've ever tried and it's from the brand Pixie. I know I've mentioned this in my videos before but it's their Endless Silky Eye Pen and mine is just in brown and my hair is really poofy today. Yikes. But yeah, it's just, I don't know, it's very pigmented and it's very creamy so it goes on very nicely. I don't know what else to say about it, it's just an eyeliner but it's very 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 pigmented so yes. Next is one of the only face products that I've been wearing besides concealer, and it is the Fit Me Powder from Maybelline. And this has been a favorite for quite some time now, but as you can see, I have hit pan on it. I've used it so, so much, but yeah, I feel like this gives, it's a very light coverage, but my skin isn't too terribly bad where I need like a whole bunch of foundation and makeup on my face, so I just use this and I think it works pretty well to my liking so I think it's great. Next product I'm going to mention is also a face product and it is my favorite blush of the month. It is my NARS Deep Throat Blush. First of all the packaging is very dirty because it just sits in my makeup drawer with all the other makeup items and it just gets disgusting. I don't know it's just a peachy kind of pink color almost. It has a lot of shimmer in it and I think it's really pretty. My last makeup product is a lipstick because everyone knows how much I love lipstick. It's my favorite. So this is actually from Maybelline and it is my all-time favorite lipstick from Maybelline and it is their Lust for Blush lipstick and it's the matte formula. I really only like matte lipsticks because I hate like I hate glossy lips. I hate lip gloss. I hate all that stuff. It's disgusting and slimy and weird and I just don't like it. I don't know. I like the way it looks and the way it feels because it doesn't feel like you have anything on but you still look good. So it's just kind of like a mauve pink color. It's great for every day. It's very neutral. It's not like too bright like some of my other lipsticks that I wear but it's just like perfect and I like it. So this is definitely my favorite lipstick to wear on a day-to-day -day basis. The first thing is my Pond's Cold Cream Cleanser and I like to use this if I am wearing like a really heavy foundation that day I will take off my makeup and then put this on and let it set for like five minutes and it makes my skin so soft and it also helps take off any excess makeup that your makeup wipe or whatever you're using um, left behind I guess. I just really like this. It makes my skin super soft and you know cleanses my face of all makeup and just makes it beautiful. And also to go with that I use the Pond's Wet Cleansing Towelettes in Original Fresh. Sorry if you can hear that noise. I This is just a mess. This is a mess for you know taking off your makeup and stuff. Um, I think they're great. I love the way they smell and they make my skin feel really nice so that's that. What more can you say about a makeup remover wipe? I mean, this was actually featured in my last video. If you haven't seen it, you should go check it out. But um, this is the Pure Door. I still don't know how to say that, guys. My bad. Um, but it is their Argon Oil. And um, I did a whole review about this in my last video if you want to go check that out. But this product is like my lifesaver. It's great. It helps with my acne scarring and just making my skin very, very soft and smooth because I have like really dry skin in some areas of my face so this helps a lot with that. Now on to some smelly good things because I like to smell good. No one likes to smell bad, right? So this has been my favorite and it smells so good. It's Pink Sugar Plum and it's from Bath & Body Works. I don't think you can get this anymore because it was a part of their winter collection in like 2013 so my bad. I have so many like body mists and things like that. I'm trying to use them all up. So this was next on the list and it just smells very good. I like it a lot. 
Alright, and obviously if you guys watch my videos and know me at all, um, I am obsessed with body lotions and just nice smelling things. The one that I'm currently using is called Amber Blush and it's from Bath & Body Works as well. I love that place so much, obviously. You guys already know this, but it is their Triple Moisture Body Cream and um, it smells like... I don't know how to describe it, but it just smells really good. I don't know, I'm bad at describing scents and smells. Next is a candle favorite, which you guessed it, is also from Bath & Body Works. Basically, this is supposed to smell like lavender, and I don't know, I guess lavender is a scent that either you like it or you don't, and Jess and Taylor don't like it. I think it smells good. I've been burning it pretty much all of March, so obviously I had to put it in this video, so yes. I don't ever do food favorites in any of my favorite videos. We're changing things up. I am not a huge, like, sweet eater. I don't eat cookies and ice cream and cake ever, really. But for some reason, I've really been loving these. And they are the Chips Ahoy cookies. But the special thing about these, and the only reason that I like these, is because they have Reese's peanut butter cups in them. And Jess thinks these are disgusting because she hates peanut butter, but I love these. A plus for these because they have Reese's in them, and I love Reese's. Okay guys, it felt like I was never going to get through that video. This video is a mess. So please bear with me, I have had a very, very long day. That is it for my March favorites, I really hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please, please, please give this video a thumbs up, and also, if you aren't following me on any of my social media accounts and you would like to, my links are always in the bottom bar and I'll have my little handle on the screen here, or whatever that's called, my username. That's what it's called. Alright, that is it for this week's video, I hope that you guys enjoyed it, and I will definitely be seeing you guys next Saturday! Goodbye, everyone!